No, I can't believe I'm out. I can't believe I'm here you mean, with you in Italy, huh? <laughs> yeah, me either. Just wish the circumstances were less tense, you know? Eh, uh, well... You know, the sights are a bit more enjoyable that way. Oh! Uh, so this, this isn't your first time here? Oh, it's more like, uh, third? Had a couple of odd jobs. With Sullivan? Well, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. There's no way up under that bridge. Well, there's that exposed beam underneath. Oh, you think you can rope it? Do I think I can rope it? <laughs> Watch this. I'm watching. I, uh... I missed. <laughs> nah, see, it's, uh, it's all in the red. Ah, see? Yeah, it's not bad. Uh, second attempt. You see that? Oh, like a pro. It's your turn. Oh. Okay, so where to next? Try. All right, no one likes a show off. Okay, come on, Nathan. It looks like you can uh, climb down and make your way over. Right behind you. attraverso un tubo e forse non potrà più camminare. Ah, bene lì sta. Ehi, hey, è scommesso sulla partita. Inghilterra vince. Inghilterra? Traditore. Ehi, hey, non confondere l'orgoglio nazionale con la realtà. Ok, we're good. Jesus, did you see him? That Renner thug was packing some serious heat. Shut up our guns. Sam, we're gonna pull this off so smoothly, we won't need them. I hope you're right. <sighs> All those years. It's the little things that you miss the most. Like what? The smell of fresh citrus. <laughs> uh, riding the motorcycle, it's little things, but they add up. Should hold. <laughs> All right. 
right, come on down. These landings are a little more painful than I remember. Yeah, tell me about it. So, uh, your other wonderful finds, uh, the ones I missed, you at least take any pictures? I wish. Elena filmed some of it, but camera didn't make it. That's too bad. I have some drawings, though. When we get back, I'll show you. You have drawings? What, are they up on the fridge or something? No, I, they're good drawings. I can't wait. Ah, this looks promising. I think you mean precarious. <laughs> oh, shit! You okay up there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. It'd suck if you missed right now. It sure would. <clears throat> but I don't miss. million bucks. Let's go. All right, I'm right behind you. Sully? Know what I love about partying with a bunch of crooks? What's that? Nobody cares if you smoke indoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Too long, boy. Oh. <sighs> you remember my dead brother, right? Victor? I'll be goddamn. Fifteen years. Yep. Good to see you alive, Sam. Mm -hmm. Let's uh, let's try keeping them alive by getting this cross, huh? Yeah. Uh, about that. What? What about that? Come on. Let me show you something. Take a look. That's Avery's cross. They brought it out of storage just before you guys got here. They changed the lot order. Take a whole pile of cash to make that happen. All right, well, how long before they start the bidding? 10, 15 minutes tops. Well, there's got to be some way we can grab it. <laughs> there is just a small matter of a few hundred eyewitnesses okay, down there. Okay, but we just need a diversion. Like? 
Like, um... Like, I don't know. But there's gotta be something. Well, if the guards see us <laughs> making for that cross... But they don't see us. Hmm? Jesus, you guys act like you never spend time in prison. If you want something dirty done, then you wait for, for lights, lights out. out. Yeah. Where's that electrical panel for this place? There's ventilation. Electrical. That's it up here. So we just have to climb up there and kill the lights. Grab the cross in the dark. There will be an emergency generator. And that'll give us a few seconds of darkness to work with. Meaning we'll have to be right next to the cross when the lights go out. So there's no way we can get that close without being noticed. Scusate, signore. <clears throat> Antipasti? I'm all set. Hi. How are you? Ciao. Would you focus? The waiter wouldn't get noticed. That could work. Huh? That will work. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll, I'll get to the breaker room. Kill the power. Me and the waiter? You're the best pickpocket. What? You head down to the floor, keep your eye on the prize, okay? Let us know if anything, uh, pinky goes down. Roger that. All right. Listen, we still got this. Ready? Ready. All right, follow me. We'll cut through the cellar. I gotta say, Victor, the years have been kind to you. Thanks. I chalk it up to going vegan. Pardon me? Really? <laughs> you kill me. Hell no. I refuse to believe. Upon return, I begin the bidding on several items from the estate of Sir Nicholas Stock. In the meantime, our garden is open. You see, I thought I had a reasonable grasp of French, or at least a passable French accent. But then a few months back, I'm with my girlfriend by the Pompidou Center. I've just sold them those pieces we, uh, yeah, obtained last year, you know, those hanging old thing. I don't know, abstract art shit. Anyway, we walk out past that giant ice bag. What is that thing, anyway? Cellar's just through there. Let's go. Well, this place is fancy. Of course they played douchey European techno. Excuse me. Here we are. Hey, let's do this. Oh, hell, it's locked. Earlier. Now what? Can we pick it? No, it's electronic. We're gonna have to find another way in. You see that? Key card, back left pocket. Yep. I'm on it. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. You sure you wanna do that? There's a lot of eyes out here. I think I can handle a simple lift. All right. Oh, real smooth. I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, I can tell. Professionals at work. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch. Hands in the air. Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. 
pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself. You're so out of place here. Can't... Find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. And lure one out of the kitchen, probably. Then let's go find the kitchen. Crap. You see a waiter in there? Nah, just more heavily armed goons. What's this? Skate wasn't on the blueprint. <clears throat> Locked, of course. Okay, plan B. There you go. <sighs> I see some fence up there. Nathan, go check this out. Here we go. Let there be light. Bad electrical in this joint. Don't suppose you brought a... F yeah, that'll do. I guess it's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Let's see. Need to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Oh, good thing Sully's driving. Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. That's a lot of really rare vintage. Yeah, maybe Alcazar can just settle for some good wine. <laughs> that's something tells me that's not gonna fly. Hey, uh, should be worried that Victor is chatting up Nadine Ross. I mean, heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. I can talk his way out of anything. There you go. This way. Hey, look the vents. That's our way out. to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding the lighter. Holding the lighter. <sighs> OK. 
Okay, up we go. Right there. Yeah, that's smaller than it looked, huh? <coughs> and a lot more dusty. Cosa portiamo a quell'odioso miliardario tedesco? Baldi looks like my size too. There's no shortage of waiters around here. Non capirebbe la differenza. che il ricettatore Fresh air here we come Hey check this out you see the building with the radio tower You mean the cell tower the what whatever listen that's the power room Yeah you're right Let's see how we get past this gate. <laughs> Sam, up here. I'll boost you up. All right. <clears throat> All right. Good thing you kept in shape. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar, heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? Ah, that must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Bingo. Found the kitchen. And of course it's locked. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that and find a window. Drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Sera. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilians, Sam. What? So he waits to put a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? No, oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm going to head back to the ballroom. It's not a... <laughs> Sam, you there? Sam? <laughs> Sully? <laughs> Great. Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I can't believe you got away with that. Oh, <laughs> we did not. Okay. Power room. I can do this. God, why did I pick the power room?
Sì. Eh, non ci pagano abbastanza. Se dobbiamo fare anche gli elettrici... Eh. Eh. Puoi dire di no. Ecco fatto. Oh. Speriamo di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Ah, crap. Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid. Where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Right, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and as of right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing it, remember? What if he calls my bluff? He won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bills? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once. Going twice. Screw it. Then we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. You'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. Now the bid has reached 130,000. We are now at 140. Nothing. Damn it. Your bid, signore, takes us all the way to 130,000 euros. Come on. Hey man, uh, starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, give me a second. The bidding stands at 160,000 euros in the room. Yes. Signore's bid makes 170,000. We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. <laughs> gotcha. Now reach to 190,000 euros. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's bid, 200,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? <laughs> Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice? Then I shall sell it for 500,000. Ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The back of power will come on shortly. It's gone. Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey, stop that guy! Fermo. What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak... Sparish. What? <laughs> Sam, tell me you got the cross. Got St. Dismas right here. You wanna say hi? Yeah, we've really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security's scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. Ehi, hey, 
i rossi ti beccano vivo, ti impiccano davanti alla villa e ti lasciano lì per un attimo. Oh. Sì. Ho visto qualcosa che si muoveva vicino alla torre. Devi farlo sapere a tutti, cazzo. E gli occhi aperti. Guys are everywhere. Si mosso qualcosa lì. Ti copro le spalle. Ehi, hey, ho trovato qualcosa. Se c'era qualcuno è sparito. Okay, maybe we should have brought guns. and get a good vantage point. Merda. Se riescono a svegliarsela, non ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. Resta concentrato. <coughs> cosa hai trovato? How we doing, Nathan? I'm on my way. Heading to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here.
Scuse. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. Oh, if you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I weren't, I would... You'd what? All right, fine. Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Come on, Nate. Don't telegraph so much. Come here. Now hand me the artifact. Do you know how many artifacts I've collected over the years? You're gonna need to be more specific. Let me see if I can clarify! Hey, look. I'm still a little jet-lagged. How about we just call it even? Oh, son of a... Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smart-ass? You know, you're breaking a lot of expensive stuff in here. If you're not careful, they're gonna kick us out of here. Alright, wait, wait! It's in my back pocket. Where is it? I guess I left it in my other pants. Thanks for wasting my time. It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there. I'm at the car. Where the hell are you guys? Uh, I just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. I'm trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign yeah. thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs> in there <laughs> I can't get to you from here you got a way down yeah yeah I think so okay I'll meet you at the driveway just head towards the ballroom all right see you there Victor I'm kind of stuck here any ideas the fastest way is through the ballroom Set the ballroom is locked out yeah well now that they know it's you guys they clear the place out here the ballroom is yeah, got it.
Almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good. Let's go. 
un attimo. Non era niente. Oh, good.
place. Sam, this way! Right behind you! Sully, we're running out of time here! Hold on, you can't tell me there! Almost there! Unless you're driving a hearse, you better hurry! I hope I don't go to hell for this. Oh, shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. He's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good, sir. Xavier's insignia. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris. In paradise. Today you will join me in, in paradise. paradise. It's what Jesus said to Saint Dismas on the cross. Right. But what about these numbers here? What do, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but. It means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise. Which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard is way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. But come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. 
With all that you two have been through together. She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. <sighs> I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. But things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and I can, I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me, yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy. All those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you. But it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah. I will. Okay. I love you too. Bye. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. Right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Now, Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kids. Happy hunting. Nice chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right. See you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah. Just, uh... Ah, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Scottish Cathedral. Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Uh, not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head...